And here's one more thing about sanctimony. It's highly ineffective. If what we're trying to do is influence each other, it doesn't work when we think we're morally superior. It's what's meant in Corinthians by, if I speak in the tongues of men, but I have not love, I'm a noisy gong and a clanging cymbal. That's exactly what happens when we try to talk to each other as if we're better than someone else, right? It doesn't come across the way it can come across. Try talking to a baby or a, or a pet that doesn't understand English, doesn't understand words very well. And if you do so with anger and resentment, it doesn't hear you, it runs away. But if you do so with love and understanding, it'll come towards you. It's what we need to do with each other. Drop the sanctimony, talk to each other with love and understanding. It also says in Corinthians that love is not irritable, it's not resentful, and it does not insist on its own way. Is that how we're doing things in this country? No, for the most part, it sounds like a bunch of kindergartners arguing with each other. No, you're wrong. No, you're wrong. No, that's mine. Let me take that. Give that back. All that kind of stuff. We sound like we're kindergartners. As it says in Corinthians, when I was a child, I spoke like a child, I reasoned like a child, but as I became a man, I gave up those childish ways. What we want to do is look at each other, love another as oneself, and send each other the spirit back and forth as we're trying to communicate with each other.